Not only can you perform volleys, passes, goal shots, overhead kicks, and a lot of other tricks, you can even stab your opponent in the heart. Hello, welcome back to the Spanless Game, where I'm playing every SNES game in order of release, and I have three games today. I have Space Football, Super Ch Soccer Champ, and Krusty's Super Fun House. And I'm sure Simpsons games are always great, right? Uh, our first game today is Space Football, one-on-one, -on -one. and apparently Space Football is played in little space go-karts on a space grid. Cool. Actually, that box art reminds me a little of something you'd see back on the Atari 2600 days. Space football. These armchair quarterbacks go 400 miles per hour, travel to exotic arenas throughout the galaxy, and thrill to the cheers of millions. Jump into the cockpit of your retrograv and get ready for the fastest, most dangerous sport this side of the Milky Way. In space football, the object is to snare the ro roving hover ball and take it to your goal, but there are plenty of hazards to stop you from scoring. Magnetic flux fields that drain your energy, spin cycles that twist you out of control, and of course, your well-armed opponent is waiting to slam your ship into permanent retirement. Play against a variety of robot warriors versus the computer, or in one-on-one -on -one action against your friends. See who has what it takes to become the ultimate high-speed hero in this fantastic game. Race across fields of play at hypersonic speed and still turn on a dime with instant reflex action. Master the gravity ray wave radar to lock on and capture the floating hover ball. Out of this world graphics, only for Trifix. Because Trifix, they're known for their out of this world graphics. Space! Look at the space football X for the display, start play, what? X for display, start to play, A for help. The spaceships take the field. Level 1. Game freaking on. How do I... Okay, that spins me. That seems to shoot something. There's the button. Alright, where's the stupid... Turn on a dime! No! Screw you! I don't know what I'm shooting, or why I'm going backwards. The dumb thing. Oh, yeah. Turd. That's not it. Here's the thing. That's the thing. I don't like when I shoot, I go backwards. Go forward! Take it to the goal. Take it to the goal. Did I win? I think I won. I don't think I'm winning. This game is stupid. I said everyone ever. It explodes after a while? That's dumb. Boy, this space football. So much better than normal football. Why would you even play normal football ever again when you could play space balls? Why does it explode after a while? It's so dumb. What? What? Get it. Touchdown! Oh, the excitement can be felt for millions of light years. Boy, that was fun. Graphics. Uh, the 3D-ness is cool, uh, you know, especially at that time. So, you know, I give it a seven and a half there. Sound is kind of lame. We'll give that a three. Music, yeah, it was all right. We'll give it a four and a half. Story, it really is none. Controls, four. Funness, it's really kind of plain and dull with just two characters on the screen. 
Uh, does it hold my attention? A one. And overall, we're going to give it a three and a half. That was Space Football one-on-one. -on -one. Let's see what's next. Our next game is Super Soccer Champ, the arcade hit. Why is it the arcade hit? Because it says so on the box. So you know it's true. Uh, that guy just won in the, the World Cup or something. This guy over here, he's just kind of floating in air. About to get kicked to the nuts by this guy behind him. Or stabbed. Balls. Take charge of the best soccer teams in the world with Super Soccer Champ! You not only manage your team and plot strategy, you get to be each member of the team, including Ace. Oh, not Ace. As you battle through a series of matches on your way to the top, you will control the active player on your team in both offensive and defensive actions. You're literally describing every sports game ever made. Not only can you perform volleys, passes, goal shots, overhead kicks, and a lot of other tricks, you can even stab your opponent in the heart. To regain the ball, your defensive players can punch, pull, soldier charge, and shoot guns. This has never before been possible in a video soccer game. Of course, there's also a referee whose name is capitalized, because his name is Referee, who will tag your players for fouling if he sees them. Select any one of eight world-class teams to captain and lead your men and ace to victory. Okay. That's exciting. Which one's ace? Are they all ace? Is he just cloning himself? Is this like the gray goo problem in science fiction? He's just gonna eat up all the resources and clone himself until nothing's left but ace? What? Sure. That's a giant ball. I did press start. Why am I pressing start again? Let's be America. Oh, okay. Player select. These are all really horrible looking people, but we'll be that guy. Chin. You go! Is my goal this way? Which one am I? I can be anybody! I'm all men! Yeah! Bizarre. Tac Tac. Famous companies advertising on the walls. Pass it. Yeah. Yeah. Shoot, 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 the, shoot the ball. Home run! Oh. Wait. Wait a minute. Why did it look like that guy was my goal? What is happening? No, no, no! But their team's going that way. They're all my goal. Everybody looks like me. Get him! Kill him! Throw it. Okay. Well, it's soccer. It's a, th probably the best soccer game I've played so far. It's better than the one we played a couple weeks ago. Uh, graphics, I'm going to give those a five and a half. Sound was kind of boring. Music, really nothing musically. Story, none. Controls, I'm going to give that a six and a half. Funness, a four and a half. Does it hold my attention? One, and overall, it's going to get a five. Super Soccer Champ, let's see what's next. Our final game today is Krusty's Super Fun House. I think we played Krusty's Fun House on the NES. <gasps> Featuring the Simpsons? Who would have thought? And we got pretty neat box art there. We got Bart throwing the switch. We're in a green shirt for reasons. And uh, electrocuting the mouse. Homer up there doing Homer stuff. Hey, kids, give a hoot. Help out your old pal, Krusty the Cloud. My official Krusty... Funhouse is infested with rats. There are over six levels in this game, and they're all crawly with little vermin. I've got my little loyal cadets, Bart and Homer Simpson, Sideshow Mel, and Corporal Punishment to guard the rat traps. But I need you to lure the filthy little rats into the traps. Before we blow up, it's in a rain on we laser blast, and we electrocute them, we crusterize the little stinkers. Oh boy! Did I mention the stinks, aliens, and flying pigs? Well, watch out for those riffraff. If you can't crusterize them, at least avoid them. They're worse than the fucking rats. Making Krusty's Funhouse vermin free is not a pretty task, Kitty Cadets. Someone's got to do it. <coughs> Kids, you may be wondering why I don't sound like I usually do. It's because I have COVID. <coughs> Ugh. It's 
sorry for the bad crusty impersonation. I forgot what he sounded like at the beginning of that. It was kind of doing a generic clown. Audio generic. <laughs> Could at least have Simpsons music. What? Hi, kids! Hi, kids! Some pesky rat. I'm not even doing that. <laughs> that hurts. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of puzzly. Puzzly game, I guess. I guess that's just a leave the stupid rat. Ah, uh, yeah. It's a cute little puzzle game. I remember. So you got to do stuff like, like, like what? Okay, what, what? Can I pick it up? Okay, there we go. And then we have to somehow. How do I... Oh, okay. Smush. Smush. Is it done? It's done. Okay, so we killed those rats. Okay. Let's see what's this one. What's this level? Crusty Flakes and Crusty Burgers. Oh my. This whole game's an ad for Crusty. I'm gonna go this way. There, there's the rats. Oh, it's just it's like the same puzzle. Well, no, it's a different puzzle because you can't put it there. They're gonna bounce on the thing, aren't they? All right, we we'll get it. Graphics, they're bright, they're colorful. We'll give them a six and a half. Sound, uh, not a lot going on sound-wise. We'll give that a two and a half. Music, mm, a one. Story, uh, one and a half, sure. Controls, uh, six. And funness, we'll give that a six. It's a fun little puzzle game. Does it hold my attention? A four, and overall, we're going to give it a six. It was Krusty Super Funhouse. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next game.